Good evening, Zimbabwe. You are listening to Studio 7 from the Voice of America in Washington. This is Live Talk. I am Kip Stube. And I'm Marvelous Simshanga Nyahuye this Wednesday, November the 24th, 2021, here on the Diaspora Forum. Tonight on the Diaspora Forum, we are talking about COVID-19, programs being run by Zimbabweans living in the diaspora, and the voter registration campaign. But first, let's take a look at the COVID-19 situation in the country. The Ministry of Health reports that four people died of COVID-19 in Zimbabwe yesterday and 33 tested positive. More than 4,700 Zimbabweans have succumbed to COVID-19 since March last year when the pandemic started. The Ministry also reports that almost 3.7 million people have received their first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine and over 2.7 million their second dose. And in Diaspora News, we look at some projects being done by Zimbabweans and Diaspora Voter Registration Campaign. Yebogambe, Mahlabe Zulu Njan, Lapelikona, Enda Wen Zonke Zumtlava, SG Neyo, Namtlake Uthelo Lue Diaspora Skangela, Ogunye Ogwel Tuge Neyo, Kuna Sekasa Kegen COVID-19, Sibon Guti, Gambe, Ien Zanjan, Gwele Zimbabwe, Siyabona Ge Uthelang Otilio Zempela Gatlet, Lua Biga Uguti, Gula Vantua Bane, Apabule Yom Kutan Lo Izolo, Watige Abanye, Apabafika Kona Po 33, Watlo Lue Vatula Gala Vele COVID-19, Lua Biga Njalo Uguti Ge E Zimbabwe, so, we have 4.7 million Aseba Bula COVID 19. We have a lot of people who are in the country. We have a lot of people who are in the country. We have a lot of people who are in the country. We have a lot of the Ezi nzuwa ngabantu haba chieneyo. Njalo lewa sekaya haba za mguti wa ngeti selabo haba tala kuti aspora. Haba nyeselabo la mtanje hii di hashtag the walk isi ya wazi kuti ngabantu wa kamba kinyo wa besuka kwa mula wa wazi bafika ya rare. Kwa mungu vese la bantu kuti kambe kumenjani ya mtubule ni kwa mantebele. Kuzo wea ke logu vota kuti bantu upalisela ugu vota peza njani. Kujalo ke mavlas. I want to know Chinga Miza in Yamufaro, Panapachurum, what you do, Che Diaspora, Apotino Tarisa, Jurquit, Guanese, Jarwa, Shes, Zimbabwe, Jurikunze, Quenica. In Indian Marvels in Fanganya, who in Dream Washington, who contributed to Finger and Rukumba, from Sorope, and the Rachel Village, Covid nineteen. Now, the Changa Tributarisa, Jurquitica, Panyaya, and the Irori, the Covid nineteen, Apotino. A buzz ratio turn of cheese with a three point seven million, but one equal evil Vachipai one number, a COVID nineteen Munica, a Parisino, Vachita Rashakari, Kuti, Kuneavo, Vacapaiwa, a number that would they say Vashika two point seven million Parisino, we a Jacuvane Zuro, a Panevan with thirty three, Vacawanica evil Vachi, but one day in the Iri, Re COVID nineteen, we a Jeva Nuvana, Vacawanica Vachishire. Asi munika parishi no pane wano 4,700 wa wani kwa iwo vachishaya kufadenda ili ratanga muna machi gorera fura. Tutari sasha kare kutinasi change tu kutari sasha shuriku itika kune shijarwa je Zimbabwe shuriku bata mabasa kasia na siyana kunze kwenyika. Uye chetozo pinda omu nyaya ye kunyoresa kufota kuti bari kunze kwenyika bari kukwani saere kutiva wani kwe iwo vachiwana mukana wekuti vanyorese kufota. Jiju rukuneza uye jiju no iwa kutiva rikunze kwe nyika vawani kwe iwo vachiwana mukana wekunyorese kufota saruzo za 2023 zisati za shika. Yes, Mavilas, our first guest is Mr. Tavo Siziba. Mm. He is one of the directors of Hashtag The Walk. He's based in Canada, but uh, they are operating a project in Zimbabwe uh, where they are trying to help uh, people in one way or the other. Uh, Mr. Siziba, welcome to the program, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you very much to all of you uh, at the studio and uh, to the rest of Zimbabwe. Thank welcome. you. Thank you so much. So uh, tell us about this project that you are doing uh, in trying to help people that uh, are investing back home who are actually complaining about uh, the loss of their investments. Okay, so basically I'll start by introducing the, the organization that I stand here for. Um, it is an organization that some of you who have followed this uh, platform, uh, VOA, you followed us when we did the walk, 
uh, back in 2018 in Bulawayo to Harare and so on. We have since uh, grown and we have since expanded into other community activities, um, you know, in South Africa, in North America, as well as the rest of, uh, uh, you know, as well as in Zimbabwe as well. And in our expansion, uh, our organization is member-based. So that means that, uh, you know, people join the organization, uh, you know, for the services that we provide and, you know, and so on, which mostly is around the issues of uh, ethnicity as well as community economic development. So uh, that being said, uh, just, uh, you know, our ability or our proximity to our people, which is to, be, to engage with people around the world, uh, we hear a lot of issues that uh, our people are facing, especially in the diaspora. And, um, you know, in uh, going on with the, you know, in trying to find ways to cover those, you know, the gaps of some of the issues or to take care of some of the issues that uh, especially our members, uh, you know, speak about frequently is where we came up with this program that we are introducing here today. It's a fairly new program for our organization, which is Hashtag The Walk. And uh, it is a program that, uh, you know, we have established because of the demand that we have received from uh, a vast uh, majority of the members that uh, belong to our group. This program is uh, called, uh, it's, a, it's a diaspora program, which has to do with security. Uh, if you may very well be aware, uh, there are so many issues that uh, people in the diaspora face when they uh, want to do projects back home. Uh, you know, that is issues of whether or not the money that they are sending home uh, is actually doing what uh, they, are, they are thinking or that is actually doing uh, what they've intended it to do, to do back home. Somebody sends money, uh, you know, at home to build a house. And then five months later, or a year later, they find out that there is no house, but they've been, they've been getting the neighbor's uh, pictures. Uh, somebody sends money home to take care of their parents or to take care of their elders or their children that they've left home and then to find out uh, you know a few later that the children are not being taken care of so this is just a, you know a need based initiative that we have started as also uh, an initiative that we are using to raise funds for the organization so that we can be able to do other community projects as well that the work does yes uh, marvelous do we have a question for him Yes, I just wanted to find out uh, what is your membership like? How have Zimbabweans received this uh, initiative that you've launched? So, um, Hashtag The Walk is a member-based organization. Primarily, uh, the, uh, the focus of our membership is mainly around the vulnerable communities of Zimbabwe, which mainly right now uh, would be communities. We are uh, regionally based for the most part of the services that we provide. Uh, if we are in Zimbabwe, we are talking about the, the most part of, uh, you know, Matebele land and the most part of Midlands uh, and so on. Uh, there are many communities there that uh, are neglected, communities that are vulnerable, uh, you know, which we have established this organization, uh, you know, to uh, take care of or to assist uh, in uh, creating awareness or in helping solve some of the issues that are in those communities. And uh, we have received very, very good membership around that. Thank you very much, and stay on the line, uh, Mr. Uh, Siziba. We now we are now joined by Mana Ngwenya, who is the project uh, director in Bulawayo. Eli chona jan mam. Si chona le ba kutu le chona jan. Si chona le ba kulu. Agu chela bantu ngoche lo rendo. Si abo ngaba kutu beng. Zatanda ubing le la a balale limbo ngi leskat sabo abas tati le ugu tiba zela papa zoslale la lamshanyen. Sisi tula uselo le tulo le ulogu sisi zaluhu ni nchi sana la bantu wakiti awagu diaspora uguti maabeni na besenza imsevenzi ya wapi tumela ismali kumbeni ama krosali eba i kuma familia zap eka take eka kubeba uguti watu la ugu sisi zaga la ganja so uselo le ulu eselo nza yote na ez i organization i hashtag the work uguti si ya fagashela ama familia zap wasi ya monitor uguti spi Logo verify, uguti leo zozmale abang abes tu melele M teni ni abo ziafinye lela na M teni ni abo. Kumbeni ngabara na ma business, uguti umundu maya ngai rani business lake, uguti izindwa ziyenza kanyenze la yena ofuna ngakona. Tina esi wenza uguti sikambe siyafika kule wendao, sivuon uguti ngempela ngempela loko ogo nzaka kukraund, yiko loko uche loay. Siyabo. Yes, Mavala, do you have a question for him? Go ahead. Uh, maybe if you can uh, just tell us uh, how is the program uh, being received and also why did you think of starting such a program? Uh, the reason why we started this program is because we are not able to do it. Yes, we are not able to do it. 
Okay. The reason why we started this program is just because we have, we have been receiving calls from uh, our members from all over the world uh, telling us about the challenges that they are facing if they are sending money back home. So many people have told us that uh, they are owning houses that they don't even have. Mm -hmm. They are having the kids that they are going to school that they, they never went to school. So that's why we decided to say there's, there's something that we can do to assist our, our people, to assist our members. Because us as well, we have been on diaspora. The, some of us, they are still living in diaspora. They are, they are facing these challenges every day. Mm -hmm. So, yes. What would you say like was your worst case scenario that you have uh, come across as an organization for someone who's in the diaspora who has been sending money? What was the worst case scenario that you came across? Something that touched me the most. Yes. Something that happened two weeks back. I think it's two or two or two weeks or three weeks back. What another lady another lady sent money home mm. to the family to go and renew her passports. And she sent 320 US dollars with 1,000 on top. Mm -hmm. And that money have gone down the drain. And right now she doesn't have a passport. She doesn't have money. I think we were really touched by this because this lady is the member of our organization. And mm -hmm. thus we, we decided that we have to do something as an organization to support our people. So when you see such a situation, how do you help? What happens then? Sometimes there's nothing you can do, mm -hmm. but at least to sit down and come up with a solution. How do we assist wherever we can? Yes, that's why in a, city, as a, in a situation like this, there's nothing you can do. Mm -hmm. Because in Mali already, it's a handile, but what we have to do, we have to make sure that what happened to her, I am saying if it was Yes, I was our colleague, marvelous one, Gana Kulman, Shona Konapo. Yes, was his letter, Eva was his. Quiet, marvelous. I will Paris, not a matter of Kunswa, Kuva, Kune, Sangan, or Rukut, Iro, Rukushanda, Nesh, Sharwash, and Babush, Rukut, the Penica, a Mukuyets of Tiba, but Sire Panyaya, you put in Marit's naked at me, Wakumosha, the one who gets Shanda, is what to no fan rapping gets cheetahs, or even to a Shmashavar Kona, and they Zimwe ama zinenge ziruka na ama yaka na shamari zirukutu miru wa mari Zinuko na kutiziruku waka imba Munozo enda kumusha pasina imba ya kawa Kana kutiva enda kuno padari ravana Marie Shkoro Mozo te enda kumba muna vana Vasikutu enda kuchikoro e, Ababa vakuta ora mama wango Kuta ora ibo kutipane muma Kutu mira mari yake kuta gazi kiswe magwaro Ake e kufambi sayi passport Kutu mira 300 ya vasi Kutu mira 1000 dollars Yes, Marie Yoyo, Yakatsaka Tika, Passport Paris na Pana. Sakavanga Varkuti, Ivo, the Sanga and Roshi Mosuane, Washakus, Wonakti, Ajiti Kere, Kuneva, we was his art was in Zimbabwe. Yes, yeah, so we have had uh, some stories that uh, somebody will be sending you photos uh, showing you a very beautiful house, mm -hmm. and yet there will be nothing that is being done. So this greatly concerned uh, this group of people that uh, ended up setting this organization. So, uh, uh, Baba uh, Tavo Ziva, so yes. tell us a bit about, so how do you help people here? How do okay. you, do they so, pay? Yeah. Yeah. So, what, uh, what, what we do is we have field agents that uh, would be able to link up with whoever you connect them with uh, to verify that what you have done or what you think is happening at home uh, for which you are paying your money is actually being done. Let's take, for instance, uh, if you are building a home, uh, you know, wherever it is that you are building it. And uh, for the, just for the sake of the record, right now, uh, because of our capacity and because this is a new uh, business project for the organization, because it is a business, uh, we are limited only because of our resources to Bulawayo and the greater, uh, you know, Bulawayo area, which is within 20 kilometers outside of Bulawayo, uh, merely just because we cannot afford to be outside yet. 
But as we grow and we expand, then we can go to other areas of Zimbabwe. So uh, what we do, we would do is we would be, you know, bridging relations between family members. We are not going, we are not saying to people, uh, this is a situation where now they are going to be diverting money to us uh, to go and do things for them. No, the only thing we are saying is you have sent money to your brother in, uh, in Arare or to your brother in Bulawayo. And uh, you want to make sure that your brother has received that money in good faith. Then we are going to follow up and you can call us and say, listen, I'm going to link you with my brother. You know, he's in this place or if you've got a farm in Zimbabwe, my brother, you know, I've got a farm in Zimbabwe and I've got uh, 10 cattle. And uh, last year, you know, I understand I had, uh, you know, five calves. Can you go and check for me, please? Just as a test. So we are just merely the ears and the eyes and the feet for you on the ground, just as a secondary layer of your own security. Uh, we are not doing this to, you know, to interfere or to interrupt with family relations, to say now, don't send money to your uh, business partner, send it to us. We are not doing that. We are not saying, don't send money to your brother or to your sister, send it to us. We are not doing that. We will charge you a fee to be able to go and meet with your brother or you know, check on your mother or your elderly father uh, you know, uh, who you want to, uh, to be checked on just to make sure that whoever you have entrusted them to take care of them, of that elderly person or that child, is actually doing a good, a good job and they are, you know, they are in good health. That's all that we are here for. And that also is something that in the bigger uh, picture perspective, also will improve relations between family members. Uh, we, we speak to people, another typical example I, I did indicate in another show, a, you know, a friend of mine, uh, you know, uh, lost just a few months ago, $4,000 sent for roofing, gone down the drain because family members, not anybody else, decided to scoop it. Uh, if you go online, just type chronicle.com and find out how many stories the Chronicle has of people that have lost. The, you know, a story that I read from the Chronicle in Bulawayo, somebody had lost over $57,000. Uh, on a property that they thought they were uh, building back home and it wasn't built. And this is across Zimbabwe everywhere. So we are just filling a gap going area by area of where we are able to reach out to. Marvelous. And also, what type of charges are you charging uh, when it comes? I, I know you said you're not going to take over arrangements that family already have, but what kind of fees do people charge for your services? Okay. So we've got a domestic uh, diaspora domestic verification uh, service, uh, you know, which a verification and, and monitoring service uh, for which we charge $50 uh, to, for, to make a trip. That includes our transportation costs, you know, and so on, uh, which is transportation costs. You're talking about the gas, if you're, you know, uh, whatever it is that we use for transport. It also includes paying the staff or the, the security personnel that are going to be doing that. So $50 for the trip. And, uh, you know, we've got a business uh, uh, diaspora monitoring and verification service as well, for which we charge $100. Now, that one uh, is when you want us to just go and check on your, uh, on your business, to go and check, uh, you know, on whether, you know, your, your, your building is being built or your construction is actually happening. So you have invested uh, 57000 like I've already said. You have invested 50000 7000 or you have sent $5,000 or $10,000 and you are busy building, uh, you know, back home. And, uh, you know, you want to have those second, that second layer of security, which is our eyes, uh, to go and check if indeed uh, what is happening is happening. We are not, uh, you know, uh, inspectors of any projects. We are not saying we are going to be inspectors of any particular project. But... Uh, all we are doing is we are saying here is a video, here is a picture, and maybe we are at your home or we are at your project place or business place. We call you, we send you videos, we send you recordings, we are talking to your family members, everybody is happy, and you are, you are also getting the proper third-party verification that, yes, I'm actually investing on something that is uh, worth it, and when I retire and go back home, uh, I'm going to find what I expected to be working for all these years, you know, intact at home. Yes, okay. So, Beng Beng Sati Mina in the S seven Zangayo, you would corner corner Gasita Teddy, a city Tina Evan Jimmy, Gasabes Igel, with Patumeli Mali as Slovenzago, 
eh, bayi tumele git kume bayi ge lugu tumeli mali kuma business partners labo bayi tumele git tina siti kupela singa mesho isi hizi sisi njebe sisi nyawo i extra layer of ubu faraz bo guti loko weno wenza yo ekaya nge mali yako ugu tumele li mali yako ekaya wienza gali e, ngabu ya ngacho futu guti kona kona uchelo lole skulu mangale uchelo oluwa kafutu ubu jelo wano ubu ushe e, parati wezi shobo lama la, ino labangani labo makelwane because we sesibe labanda ba nengi haba stinta yu lapa e, bekala nguguti e, haba sakulumande haba sakulumisande shobo zabo nguguti li nguguti li bezelani so tina kona lapo sesibe yi you know yi preach to say you know what gagu agula siti ngoso guti wenza gali kona loko so eh ngasen beka njalo ama examples ukuthi abantu bangangena ku internet eh abangela experience a first hand yokuthi sikhuluma ngani lapha ngoba le into a very very serious and i see onto futhi egxile ezimbabwe kuphela lamanye amazwe akhala ngayo yona le into as long as abantu bekudiaspora there will always be other people to take advantage of them so tina lapha siwe esikutsho ukuthi khona khona xa umuntu eh ekudiaspora uh, you know, a tumela imali ekaya, ukuthi is you know, uh, abe wazu, ukuthi kule ofisi ekaya onga ifonela, nga ufunu ukuthi uh, iye kuchekela, kumbe, maybe they're saying ama quotations, ufunu kwa wazu, ukuti, kula ma companies akepi zborane ekaya, uh, sebe kutumele, uh, i quotation, ukuti kute company day la day la day, uh, tina, because it's on the ground, ya kwa nisi ukuti, si cheke lao ma companies, kumba cheke kwa kuwa municipala, kumba cheke kwa kuwa government, kumbe ngapi, Eh, siku cheke le smeke shugut kwa kwa na eh, you know for sure into le hawa kuluma ngayo eh, you know li kini so gawu gawu jelwa is mali nge ngelenga isi yeah, so li taulu sa mali ni briefly kwa napo kwa mafsa eh, si taulu sa for, so for uguti si hambe siya kucheke la ngagu kui uguti siku kangile la okwa ngekaya eh, lokano uguti imuli kumbezi nsika taba nyaman bafunu kucheke lu kutama raita ba apata lwa hini ku city council laba le zindu laba lama properties and so on Eh, ugu follow up into as fana la lezo ugu kange laba ntwana ugu tinge siye cheku ugu tinge in good way you know help si chacha fifty dollars ugu tinge si hambi fifty dollar le eh, include kumbe ngiti include as well i transportation inte ngo ugu tinge siye figa kona ngale la pesi ya besi siya kona eh, logu pata laba ntaba za guya kona ngale eh, into as fana la lezo eh, so ama administrative cost ama logistics wong and then special siva le business a verification and monitoring uh, aspect which is leyona <coughs> ikangelele abantu abakhayo eh, abantu abalama business abantu abalama plazi abantu abale ezinto abazenza labanye abasekhaya besenza imali ukuthi khona khona lathi nxa umuntu ethena ngicela liye ngiliye ngiliye ngikhangela ku business partner wami ngila phana kumbe liye liye ngikhangelele plazi nilami ukuthi khona khona inkomo zami zikhona izwe into ezesiqanjwa lapha lathi sesihamba ngobungane sisiya khona lapha sisiya khangela Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. we also have a video uh, from Richard uh, uh, Moyo in South Africa. He's talking about the importance of investing back home. Let's listen to what he's saying here. Kuvaka musha chuncha kakosha shukuru kana kuva munu ano tenga mombe ka utenga zifuyo. So atino zaotu mkore uno watiri kutenga mombe mombe zaka wanda ziru kupira kufani nzara. So kafani fundi si moyo ndaka tenga utenga mombe umu gorila 2006 Sanda Rora and Tanga Monday Tanga Saka Jinch Mombizaka Saka Decatur and Ego to Bantinga Guna to invest in the Mond Makorana, Tiri, a Sanyan Scubu Dida. No cotis and Okoanda, no Shandar Kunzekinika, the Mombis Bio Fane, Mombi, a Zemana Kumanongo, a non Kishan, and a come Tangrek twenty fourteen, Zaka Biwa, Zose, Saka, Zuzaka Kosa to an oil invest, we foot in Kuvaka Misha, Kuvaka Mosha Kosa, and another Zimbabwe. Kwa muri kose kuma tima nenyika, muri kana waka waka musha wako wazi wakira naka. Yaka naka, uifu tunukuru zote wa mwaini veste. Kana maricha hiyo, uifu peso kwa unika kwa tingu gara. Vane waka vura mwa accounts, mwaka inda kuma bengi, yaka sena siyana. Vano nguwa chini veste, even wana African bengi, wana abu za na FNB. Saka tunukuru zote wa mwaini veste. Nukuti wana waka wanda, wana kumu mwaka musha. Wana kumu kuna South Africa zi unika. Wana kukanganwa, uifu tiba mwono. Wana nga waka ura mwe, nukutu waka mwotumina mari kwa ama za utu wa kiwe mwusha, utu wa tenge we mwombi, wa isa tenga mwombi, wa chingu wa suka kumusha, kwenzi mwombi ya ya biwa, suka kazo dae, suka kazo dae, suka kazo dae. Uwe futi ze, kana kutenga stenti, kakanaka, asitira sa naendika mkatima stenti, zoda ku mira ni simba, kutukuna, unu tenki sa wakumba singa itu, mangwana, unzore pa putsu, mangwana, unzore pa, pa, pa dirizo. Saka suka kusha, kutama research, pa kutumunu, munu nufonti, a university, especially nguwa ya chirine, ati university, inu kuwaka, nisha, kana kutenga ma stenti, Kana kumuwaka kumusha shaiko. 
saka sunu sunu ngezwa kwa hivyo mombi kwa hivyo wa biriki wedu matiti matiti guru wakanga wa shitenga mombi wa shitra rama nazo tisewa na shikoro asima kura atila na mvura ayesinia nye kuna yeswa kanaka ni nawe in climate change zi nzwa kwaonda zwa kuparara zi nzwa kwaonda mombi za kupira kufa saka ndiloku za utuwa nawe zimbabwe wa muri mose ni mwatari ni mwateri ngati wakei rama mwa na redu tisa guna kufarai wa nukutenga zi moto kari moto kari ai gari ino kukurumiza kupara chai mkuba saka muni muni unufanyina kufani something chani ita mpini wako waka musha kungwa kana kuruzevo wako musha wako tukuna na waka wanda waruku waka misha javu wachi sama sola wachita mageze masola saka suzi nge zaka kusha hezo suzi nge zaka rongeka na utasai muni tiri kuna kufuminu kuunze kwe nyika jineva na wama sangana zungungua wano shaya tu batainda na waku musha tasuka waku musha avana peku gara muna no chemiri wa mgadini kofi ni so mgadini saka zunu sina kumira zwa kana kanji no kuru zira wana baba kutu unzi baba kufa ni musha kutika vimba ni kwa chino gara kuno kwa unka kana kati loja asikana wa shingi wazo parara mozimai kana pasi na peku gara anu vahenda saka zwa kaka kosha kufaka musha tu murigo gara kano kuru loja sante zunu zinji saka ngati wake musha wana baba ngati kuru zi ngati saka guna kufara irwa kune wano wako wako kana kufara irwa ni zungu zinu Zisini maturo na upenye wedu Saka tilongo tituwe zwa kanaka Tuzibada zwa kanaka Mkatimi nikei South Africa Mchengi tezwe Tinoimba tuma permit Ano chimira waka wanda Asha evapo Tulamba shungu nyingi tira Chukumbira mwari Tuzia zomu ya zuwa nesu Panguwa zgeda sazino Tuchengi tezwe mu December Christmas ya Shredira 2022 ya Shredira Tufatu pindi tose Niropa raji yesu Amen Tufatu pindi tose Niropa raji yesu Amen they are marvelous, say you heard him saying that uh, you know it's, it's very important to actually invest back home. So he's encouraging people to actually do that kind of a thing. So it is of interest that he's saying some of these things. And I think we are joined by some people right now, so we we'll just have to mute them a little bit. So now, uh, marvelous, I think you got cut off. Uh, I cannot uh, see you right now. I think you are going to join very shortly. Let's hope uh, marvelous is going to join us. So um, now let's let's wrap up this with uh, 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 Miss Ngwenya. I think Miss Ngwenya has been cut off. So abantu of physical tiba li tole baba sisi baba li tola ngapi. Ama fichani sivili sitle skete ule ule lola. Okay. So niyabo nga baba. Ii zakala nge ngogu kuluma nge website. Ugo tisile website. Ii website yetu yimtuagazi heritage investment fund dot com. And uh, Imtora's Heritage Investment Fund uh, dot com ungena guyo for laba abaine lisugut bangi ne Imtora's Heritage Fund dot com uh, gule contact section gu website yet to onga ya kona uh, uye tola uh, ama contact uh, the details uh, to our address in Bulawayo is number forty nine Robert uh, Mugabe Road and Fourth Avenue which is opposite the Highlanders Club and then uh, I'll give the phone numbers the phone numbers for our offices. The landline is uh, plus 263-29-226-2354. Uh, that is the landline. And then the WhatsApp tele, uh, telegram lines, uh, which is the cell phone, is plus 263-78-635-9201. So that is uh, our uh, contact information. And from there, we will be able to, you know, to work with people. Um, we say that, uh, you know, we, we are available to assist with uh, any concerns that people have, uh, you know, that they want just somebody who is at home uh, within an environment that is very trustworthy. It's an organization that is going nowhere, uh, that has many people behind it already. So if you want to just give a phone call to the organization, say, guys, uh, I've got something happening there. Can you check for me? You know, I've, I've got my, you know, my, my, my house in this place. Can you go and check for me? And just take pictures and send them to me, uh, whatever the case may be. You know, I'm trying to, uh, to, to make sure that my taxes are being paid at the city council. Can you go and verify for me? We can do all those things and other services that pay case or pay need. When people call us, we can always talk. Yeah, thank them. you very much. Uh, marvelous, uh, maybe. I wako tanga tuku ulikuwa kupa kunye sanga norikuta ora iro kutipano waliko yu wachishanda na zushar wa shwe Zimbabwe Shiriku nisekwe nyika wachiwa batisira kutiba waliko yu wachidongo rela kune my investments arupitu kwa kumusha waliko ora iro kuti mwenezi mwenguwa wangu wanwani kwa uzgoti marezi nezimwe shukukansu nushaka badarwa 
Ushaya mungu anu kwa nisa kusuyenda kuno wana utundisho ilesha kaya itika. Ndoshi change shulikitu kwa nisanga nuravo. Yes, so I think, uh, Mr. Siziba, thank you so much, but uh, you can hang around so that uh, in case we need some more questions or issues, we'll come back to you. So now I think uh, let's focus on the uh, voter registration exercise that is going on worldwide. So we've got so many people that are campaigning, you know, marvelous. Some of them are based in London, some are in South Africa, all over the world. Even here in USA, it's the same thing. So we had invited people to come and join us. I think uh, maybe they are joining us shortly. So you can go ahead and talk about this, Marvelous. Mm -hmm. But maybe before we do that, there's an issue that's really affecting uh, the diaspora, the issue of people getting tele-medical uh, help from doctors that are actually based in Zimbabwe. Uh, but we've seen that, you know, people that are based here in the diaspora have parents in Zimbabwe. And during this time of COVID-19, some of them, you know, have issues of how do you monitor whether your parent is getting the assistance that they need uh, from a doctor. So that's one of the issues that we as a family actually came across uh, just last week where we had to use one of those tele, you know, medicine um, organizations where, you know, the doctor had to go and uh, look at a relative to make sure that they're okay, we're able to give the medication, but we were doing it from here. So those are some of the initiatives uh, that Zimbabwean doctors are coming up with uh, in Zimbabwe. I think as we go along, the, I did send you a video of uh, one of the women uh, that speak about uh, this uh, telemedicine uh, program that they have in Zimbabwe. Uh, maybe when we're done with the vo a voter registration, we can uh, just play a snippet mm -hmm. okay. uh, where she shares about how they're also working with people in the diaspora, uh, like what uh, our former guest was saying, uh, because this is in real time where people need real uh, help at home and they wonder, you know, who do you consult? And, uh, you know, I was very interested in, in uh, what our, our last guest was saying, that when you Google the number of problems that actually Zimbabweans have faced, those mm -hmm. in the diaspora when it comes to their investments, it's amazing. And some people don't even speak out because a lot of uh, families are breaking up, but they can't speak up because this is family. How do you complain? Uh, so very interesting there indeed. Maybe you can pose that uh, question to him. Maybe they do this kind of uh, medicine thing as oh, well. Yeah. I was yeah, talking yeah. about um, there is a, an initiative that is being done by Zimbabwean doctors in Zimbabwe where they work with uh, you know Zimbabweans in the diaspora by providing okay. services to the family back home. So what you know people here pay directly to them, I think online or whatever mm -hmm. method they use. Uh, mm -hmm. but I don't know, is there synergy for your organization and organizations like that? Yes, that is a, a scenario. Okay, sorry. So that is a situation that actually we have also faced uh, with, uh, you know, with uh, the community when we engage with the community in the various other programs that we engage with. Uh, you know, a, a scenario such as what you have described now. Uh, are we actually doing it ourselves right now? We are not doing it right now. And simply because of just the capacity aspect of it, when we grow, just like as I indicated that we are working right now because it is a startup program for us. So we are only within 20 kilometer radius outside of Bulawayo and within Bulawayo as well. Uh, also looking at growth as well. Where can we grow out to? There is issues, there is gaps, there is problems that need to be resolved. And, uh, you know, that's a typical other problem that I know is, uh, you know, everywhere across Zimbabwe for people that have uh, family members who have health issues, uh, you know, who need medication and uh, who need, uh, you know, to make sure that, uh, you know, their, their welfare is, is, is well protected. So when we grow, pay need, when people communicate and contact us and say, you know what, can you help here? We are, you know, obviously going to be unlimited in the way that in, in our expansion. But uh, yeah, it is definitely a need. Yes, you know, so yes. payment so essentially look at it, 
eh, ngenze la wena oya bu patele leo madi gumbo oya bu uhambise lolo sizo eh, ugutwa na gegelo yini as what you expect so eh, sasta ngela kwa nenga bandi be, 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 you know be kuluma ngako kona loko as a missing eh, you know a challenge that we ogumelu guti eh, isolvi we tina njenge nsanga niso as if kadi sele i business as kuluma ngale lapa eh, besi ngaga kwe besi ngaga fi nye deli gulo gulo shelo olo guti singene kuma medical services or eh, kukangere na bandu eh, nge ma health issues abo eh, not because eh, gasi soge si fige pati ngogu kula eh, le, le, you know le, le, la bandu besi za giti it demand per se uh, you know, see, I wouldn't say that we could definitely, uh, you know, the service always a melu to see provide in the near future, but you know, you know, it is you can possibly a corner could. Yes, I was a good story of a good office. Oh, mama, oh, gonna have a good lawyer. Would he come be pinking a lay in Ganan, a meaty, a manguin? About to about the Alabacula, Abane, the Bantanabacula, got a whole abandoned alternate diaspora. So, a meaty if you and Jan Conapo, I want to be to mess. Yabonga in Colise Ukuti in a trick layer, yeah, in Supaganga. Yeah, Guru Supo Olu Kuluga Kuru Evangin by Giti, and a ill life I call Lula Evangin Abagutas for a Bichia Abatali mover, Bichia went to an immover. Moreover, Umuntu Injel Oya before I went again a corner, so the Gwens again, Joe, who said to us. So Lutu, Olu Kuluga Kulu, so you call is is it as in Changa Neso Sasuma, Moguana the Nessus into everything, Mogutilla Lazo, Moguzu the Mafon in Evandri, Sasuma Zawanuti, you call a lati in Tok Fanny Lessians, who was Avandu I get to be told who was the Ran. As well as the Lusses by Echilo Lapa Ugutikona, we organization as a Suga Pansi, Lel business, Salisusa Pansi. Is into Esses of Finele Lagiz, Uguti Avantava Dalla, the Tolle Ugusazaral, Lavantu Abagutas, Pora, the Tolusazaral, the baby was Uti E corner E organization, E was Ugunet and Uguna Gagala Avatar. Yes, I was our colleagues. Tell one the Conapa Mamma Sassel Lobaba, a Conapage, Ose Genle, a Unusana Enest Chanuke, a Uguban and MTC Alliance. A Mr. Chanuke, welcome to the program. Welcome. Uh, thank you very much for having me tonight. Thank you so much. Before we go into politics, maybe we can talk to him about this issue concerning some of these diaspora issues. Hey, marvelous. Go ahead. Um, I'm not sure if we were able to access the video, but uh, I, oh, do you speak Shona? Yeah, he, he speaks Shona. He's NSJ. Um, okay. Dr. Yes. Shona, uh, Dr. Shona is, I can also hear in the valley. I can speak Zulu. Yeah, I'm multilingual. Ah, good, good, good. Ah, Patrick, sorry, I'm in memory. Kubi. Mutara nindrugu mpumala in South Africa. Ndiri in communication secretary. I'm the spokesperson for MDC Alliance in South Africa province. All right. I want to put it out of the team. You look from the same panya yetu nyo resa kufota. Before, before maybe going into that. Let's hear a bit about some of these problems or challenges that are being faced. By Zimbabweans like you, Mr. Chinyoka, Chinyoke, when it comes yeah. to sending money home, investing back home, who is actually handling, you know, some of these things for you? You know, some of those things. Let's be maybe, very honest here. Yeah, maybe South yes. Africa has a different kind of scenario. But yeah, maybe, let's hear from him. Yeah, Because uh, you are closer to home, but do you face some of the challenges that uh, Zimbabweans that are really far away from home that like here in the united states or in australia in canada in the united kingdom who can't readily go home uh, do you face such issues that we have been reading about and you know some you know people have faced personally where they've lost uh, some of the investments because they are not on the ground yeah thank you very much uh in english and also a bit of the way so that uh, i will be able to speak to all the audience uh, when it comes to the issue of investment back home it is not only an issue which you are speaking about to say people in uk or people in america are the only ones that are affected this issue is is, is affecting everyone uh, in what way because there were genuine people who were actually uh, doing property and also selling stand genuinely so but because you see how what happened in zimbabwe that the ground then became volatile 
that it is not easy now to uno tumira marukumbo but kuna muno eh so zenda wana stand in onondi wakira imba or muna not i'm an agent i can help you build your own house we have got several issues and incidents that people come back to us to say hey I was trying to invest in this. I bought a property in this way. I've got a friend of mine who actually sold his car to rush back home because his tent was being taken by somebody else. So we, we are having almost the same situation and problems that you're actually reiterating in this pro in this program. So can you put it in Shona as well? Just go ahead, sir. Okay. So that is only uh, my, my problems are true to Araguti, Vanaru investor, or Vargu Timira Marcumba. Kujivatenge zimba banga chenga mastent. Tugu wana kuti vanda wanda wargu wargu no kumana despo wargu na South Africa. Enana potswana. Pawa kuti mbira maru kumba. Kuna vano vai chenga sa mastent. Vai chenga sa zimba. Saganak. Padi manje no kuti mamiriro aita zinu kumusha. Vanda wacha kwani se manje kuti ogampa maru kuti ugutanga imba. Tine vano sijaji sara dine shanga riang. Anga chenga imba kushtunguiza. Eh, angani ma paper ese, eh, uti zinza atenga siri genuine. But paga zoe nda manji, ashidagu no wana panga pa atenga pacho. Anga zoe wana uti, panga pa atenga serwa, shanga tutori istandi ya mwe mwe. Sadikuti so, eh, eh, zatikuti ya wana program muno mu, asusuka afekti ya wana warukure cheti, ne wana wana muno mu South Africa, zuruku wa afekti hao. Mm. Mavros? Ayi wana paka wama na uti dopa na ida wanya zonzi, misi saipa po kuti, ii, wana mu South Africa mnenge mwuri pedo ni kumba. Munota risana na shoiri. Popanya ya ye kurwari wakumusha uye shoye nekuzo shaya kumita vani. Maka mira se hipapo. E, panya ya ze kurwari wakumusha. Njuta kuti ndi, ti, ti, ndi, ndi isende nzire ya kada iso. E, vanu waka wande waka waya kuno. Wanga wacho awana kura nepama board, awana ma passport. So, ne situation yiriko manje, unu gona gona uti munu arwari ilwa. Kana tukuna munu ashai kakuno. And the only thing I could say is that I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. And I don't know how to do it. So I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. So my problem is that I don't know how to do it. 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 How, how, how serious is that issue? You know, because we know that uh, many Zimbabweans are not documented. And so, when you've got a little bit of money, you can't invest at home, right? It's difficult, right? It, it's very difficult because Munam South Africa, to tell you the truth, my Zimbabweans are under Vargu, Vargu Raramba, they are getting a life. Just with no kwansa kwa ni kuchasai, kuzachi, kuzga papa tafura, vana wojga, wojga, oti mbro ozi, nige zasara kumusha. Agus kuti van vesar kuno kwaru nyaso rarama life e kuti varu diaspora zuri kudiaspora vango ndo kuti varu ngo rarama ne ma basics avu kwatsa kuana kuti mari zaru kushandro kuma peace job ane kwaru ma peace job ne vango kwaru ma basa kuti se se kwaru zinomuru kuzau tipe ne nyaya yema ZSP yego tipe ma permits angati api wa ne urumende a sati a a a a extend wa so tuka chomi riro kuti urumende pa ino taroti zinu zaka mira kuti so wada wada tia vaka chomi riro kuti zaka kuti but we just want to just extend what happened. Extend we just a mirror saying. Just read that one. Because upon the mirrors, as now we are going to push out to maybe war war. I can't say that we found it because I was going to see what it is. Just a little bit. So so remain there. You know, South Africa is it. It's just a deep hole. You know, the feedback. Could you say a mirror say? Paris, you know, we say I can go mirror. Could you say a mirror say? So can I war war war? We push out as a school. As this in your Nangu ti eh nangu majan ku mushat induro na di maya baruara kasi guru baruara ti neva nuwa kashai kiro neva bereki bari muno basi nangu kwanza kuenda kuno viga ba bereki ba so mara we have to follow kumfoy we have to put investment eka we kata zan kuti investment di mangzeng mangbuga kasi mangti ngai bega nje la nje ngati au kasta au kata zinga leonje la ngoba mauzo ba ukona ugu tumela logo longa ne eka ya ya wana ugu investor enda ondo zuba unge kogu uyo akufani ne ugu investor enda ondo uyo lo kona kona njenga manje uzo tola gala kuti abandaba ningi ba investor la pona ba kona njenga ati kesi investor la las kona masesi puno kwenzi ito kula po leza ma ugu tisi tole leso skati tu ziyambe siye kai so singata bantu ba li chonche la pekaila kunzi mala 
ngenye futhi bayatshonja abantu ngoba basubo bonke abantu eh labanga yenza laba ukuthi sithi abayenza ibusiness ngendlela yakhona eh abanye bakhona laba yenza kahle ibusiness wathi ma investor ngabo oma uthumela imali ma organization waba waphatha kahle ngoba angeke saze sathi wonke umuntu vele uyatshonja mara khona akhona lama incidents lawo ekuthi vele bakhona laba khuluma ko abakhona vele ukuthi baduzane nathi laba sisherela lezinto ukuthi kuna ma challenges lawo ukuthi abakwazi ukuthi bathembe ma ukuthi kuna ma investment mara akhona ma organization la themba kale ekhaya akhona ma organization la genuine ekhaya angeke sithi onke ma organization bayotshela abantu bakhona laba yenza kahle ibusiness ende bakhona ku ku investor ukuthi uyakhona ku bathemba izinto ezizingamba kahle yes we've got uh, mr tabo siziba he belongs to an organization called hashtag the walk so they are actually trying to help people like you and uh, me and others you know who are trying yeah. to invest at home and maybe money is not going very well so mr ziba i think we have heard yeah. what mr chinyuke is actually saying so he's very much yeah. concerned about you know investment back home because some of these mapwins are not documented so it's difficult mm-hmm. for you to invest at home and go and monitor your programs so can you tell him what um, you are doing as hashtag the work yes so what uh, we are doing for instance the scenario that uh, my brother has explained there is a scenario that is real at home that we are facing every day because our organization is member based so that means that we have uh, you know we, we are recruiting members every day into our organization for the community services that we provide and for what we stand for and uh, you know we have faced many people in south africa uh, in botswana uh, that have come forward uh, you know with those kind of challenges sometimes the service that we are speaking about here which we are providing uh, which is the verification and monitoring and so on is not motivated only by the dishonesty or the, or the potential dis, uh, dishonesty of people that you may be dealing with it is simply because of that issue where the gap could be that somebody just cannot travel uh, to go home uh, most importantly if you realize over the past uh, uh, you know, a year and a half, COVID has uh, gotten people stuck across borders. Uh, so many of those people uh, that are stuck across borders, some of them, they don't even have the, re- the relatives to be dishonest. They just don't know uh, who to be in touch with to get uh, help with whatever they need to get help with. Some people have left their houses with strangers or with, uh, you know, their houses vacant, uh, their plots vacant because uh, they've asked maybe neighbors to keep checking or to keep an eye. So uh, the service that we are providing is to take care of many needs from different situations amongst our people. It's not only focused on, okay, somebody is going to steal money from you. That is a primary you know, a challenge uh, that we have, uh, you know, a lot of as well. But also there is other issues that uh, could be the cause, which is such as what the gentleman described earlier. Uh, undocumented, you know, people that cannot travel, COVID stuck people that are stuck because of COVID and various other issues. Yes, Mavras, go ahead. Aha, Tombo, Pinda Panesha, Matungi, Wenika, Epanya, Nurefa, Kufuta, Murkona, Shakamira, Sip. Panya, Nurefa, Kufuta, Kuno, South Africa province, e, Tatanga, Guita, Tinema workshops, Atinao. Eh, hey, Msoa 27, kune workshop ni ngeri kukufutu kujobek. Ketiri nde ipi. Patiba nuatanga kuhunyore sa kuhinda kuhunyo workshop. Sa tuku za magui ita kuma Zimbabwe za arimuna msoa Afrika. Tuku wakuru, tuku wakuru zira za kanyanya. Kuti ngawa ende pa bed bridge. Azi, chero chigara kwa harare, chero chigara kwa mtare, chero chigara eh, eh, kubinga. Tuku wakuru zira kuti ngawa ende pa bed bridge. Any voter station ya kavuru ya kuti unono nyoresa au ufani ya kuti uzo sika kwa wano gara kuti unono nyoresa ndo sinu satu misa baka kwa kuru zira kuti kiasi kunga nda pa bed bridge unono register sa kukufota so how, how do people travel when they don't have uh, proper documents some of them you know like maybe the majority Mr. Chinyuke right kuna hawa basi nama document takati anga program ya kuti tiku kuru zira nagu Nukupa wa nukune system ragu shanzo kwa nukupa console jedu yiku Zimbabwe yiku ti vanu argu register online kutu you book yourself kutu no say unotura passport yako 
a consulate so you can do it online then you know you know you are dead over to an appointment time you know she has submitted my document over to me my document ago musha my document is ago by process of passport ago by way could you know so is that what you tell us today my members edu mdc alliance i got you one day i can so good at the end of the new resa could you have my passport could you ever can so good as a window no you're no good is that we are not here that you could zero and lose in bab could you could tell us that night upon my facebook in the corner on whatsapp no one on a twitter to no good about tower at it as yes but take us up one never knew one of one is a good zone in your essa could you have one circles of water this is the dead cheaters so i've another no good to go for tira i'll watch the pics on an hour so those are good i'm a good one was that you are cool that can also not my paper i was also came as i go we are going to control it no one to me ramon gomusha i to me to pachago i to me in a bit certificate yago uno kwasa kwa na passport pa control it vari go watu tanga kwita process iroro vari go watu tanga kuapply dozi zuguti ee ee zuguti fadza zaganya kuti wawo watu kukwanisa kuti wara na wote wakono kupinda kuti kuno churongo chongi yorisa ma passport vari kwenda kukonsol it vari kubasirika zaganyanyi how much does it cost to actually get a passport or something like that wara kukwenda kukonsol it Eh, my prices, a eh, 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 passport, uno so bad, I got a wind up Musha. Ku consulate, you just go, uno no process, I'm a document dago. Panono Tumera Munda, no no submit, Rakmusha, no Panono choose out. Ruda passport, no Budana, na one day, no Dana Budana two weeks, no Budana Pudana food, no Budana in any three months. Ma, ma rates are ego, eh, my passport, are gathered in the government. Do I think I don't go charge. So as you see, no so charge, one Maria Garcia and Nerucha Gomusha is still the same amount. So tell us in English about what you are doing in terms of your program, a voter registration campaign, and what you are doing uh, about those that don't have proper documents. Thank you very much. Uh, what we are doing uh, as uh, MDC Alliance in South Africa province, we are we have we have started as a, a, a campaign whereby we're having workshops. We are workshopping every Zimbabwean that is uh, here in South Africa on the voter voter registration. So. We are encouraging Zimbabweans to go to Bait Bridge. Just go by Bait Bridge to register to vote. You don't necessarily need to go to the area where you come from. For voter registration, we say when you just cross the border and go to Bait Bridge, you are able to register. But in the events that you don't have documentation to go to be able to pass through the border, you don't have a passport. We are encouraging the, 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 the children of Zimbabwe to go to the consulate website and you register yourself to, to, to apply either for a, a birth certificate or you apply for a passport. But we're encouraging Zimbabwe to apply for passport. So if we say maybe you forgot your ID at home, we encourage you to send somebody to Korea your ID copy or to put it on a bus or normal way of sending goods home and then you get your document then you go to the consulate and you'll be able to apply the normal application process payment will only be done when you send your passport to the passport office in zimbabwe where you choose if you want to have a one-day passport or a two-day passport or two-week passport or a three-month passport depending on the duration which you want your passport to take to come out the monies which are gazetted by the government then they then apply but our our issue which we're encouraging to say every zimbabwean that is in south africa please if you don't know how to apply for uh, the passport to the consortium i'm going to also leave my number so that they will be able to contact me and you are going to be able to assist them thank you marvelous now vajinji wanga varu kunyanyo chema chema panyai iyo yi ayye kuti magwaro akada yise ma passport wanga wasinga kwanisa kwa awana consulate chirongwa yi chaka tanga rini chirongwa yi chaka tanga chaka chaka tanga chaka tanga kutanga kwe kore but no go to people in covid my office and i'm both are but my office the concert is just a couple parties you know i got for man so i'm not here a a a a a process that would all right while i'm going up like a bit of a website or apply in seven days no up you are mazua zuaro no fan of you you know submit a map about what the passport you go concept we process yeah i would tell about to go to the local zenini jalori and up you are i'm afternoon gonna oh see kuru banyan zabayogu register for chaka jalo me see please have to say about being a little a see south africa province a ceci kalile uba a new voter registration campaign la 
eh, emzansi i province ya South Africa iyaziti ifara u Namibia ifara i Botswana ifara futi nge Zambia that is why si ibiza kuti i Southern Africa sisi kalile i voter registration campaign eh, mshaka 27 si tobasina i workshop kona lapa e koli e chobe le si tobas kona si, 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 si fundi sa abandu nendaba yek funde la eh, uguti hini le si tobas si experta abandu mabafuni yore tita vote kaya eh, si kuruma anjalo si South Africa eh, MDC Alliance eh, sisi kalile lelo loguti kutata eh, onge ama Zimbabwe la kona la kaya la kona futi ku e Botswana na sena Namibia uti ababuyele ekaya bayo register ukvota ma kona la ekoli e South Africa ma pepa ago agase si kutata uti au hambe uye lapa e Bed Bridge uyo register kona ukvota au katata gile uti wena ubuya api wendega ubuya harare ubuya emutare ubuya e pinga si de hamba e Bed Bridge uya wazi uyo register ukvota ma uti wena au nao ama pepa Siti, strela ungene la po website ya Zimbabwe Consulate, uzo chola la po mbili ngwane, nale link yotu ya wazi kuapplaya online, uzo konu chola ilanga, la baso kisele la lona, utu yo submita ama pepa ako, ma baso kinike za ma chokimendo ako, so ya wachumele kaya, lopo lo wazi kona, kutu yo apply li passport, kuzo wazi ku register kufota. Ni kutote abando wa dawagi iti uti, unga register kufota, kufana no mundu, lo votele labo, le speak sana na abo. Yeah, marvelous. Fara mwenye mbozo kona. Hmm. E tu mbozo kena ilu panya ya ye diaspora vote. Pane jamuru kuita ere uh, kweza kutimu. Wani kwe mchi e, kweza kana uti mchi kuru zira urumende kutipane ni diaspora vote. E, pa, panya ya diaspora vote. E, Ziri po za ma programs atatanga uti tite, tite, tite tubi inge jana ne, ne urumende. But but it's you know, so this year is not only Munum South Africa. Tegabati na futi ne UK branch ye MGC Alliance. Tegabati na futi ne America branch ye MGC Alliance. Tine ma programs atugu ita atugu ita ma consultation program uti atugu approach aguru mende tiji wa kuru zira uti. So this is Zara Zim Zimbabwe ziri kuna kuma diaspora. Tiri futi isusu tugu tumira mari ilugu ita ati nyika ikwanisa kuya pa ikwanisa kuya pa I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I Tuku kwanza kuno re, kuno register ma passport. Tuku kwanza ku 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 access as in muno diaspora ku ma consulate. Chiji kuti misa kuti tisa kwanza kuno vote. Kwati tuku enda suti ma Zimbabwe kuti kwanza ku ana ma paper. Thank you very much. Kato changa kuti tuku 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 enda ku Zimbabwe tuku 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 enda ku Zimbabwe tuku 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 Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Our time is almost up. Let's uh, hear what uh, Pastor Richard Moyo says about some of these issues. Life talk. Nemi, Baba, Dude. Ya na wii kurejisa kufota chini chaka kosha shukuru asida mbujikura kito sanga naro kwenye nye kwa chiru kuno kukunze kwenye nye kawana South Africa Ida mbujikura kuhombe nukuti zinu zinu chile mera kana kule mewa nwaka wanda Kutuwa nwaka wanda vahe ndi kumusha e, vashindo register kufota Asi chini chandai shuviro daisha yitwa nungike edie Zimbabwe Vahifanyira kutikuma embassy kuvene kukurejistira kana kurejistira online chini chakata sahi chocho chini chini ingi chaka kosha zukuru nene kuti reshua ugere kunze kwenyika e, kuti uye ndi nurejisa kufoda zi mungu wa unusika kwaka vagwa e, saka zao zaka kosha kwenyika edi zimbabwe e, kutuwa kutai seova nanu gara kunze kwenyika saka fona na South Africa kuno 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 kurejisa kufoda kwaka kosha kumono ese we fusha le kuru zinzu kutu zinzu zinga guna kwe mewa kawanda kutuwa nuregista kufota kwenye Zimbabwe nene makosi mafambiru mkati mungu wa zinu COVID-19 azo zaka kusha kutikuwa anu wano guna kuwa ni msanga na yawe ya nuda wakati mapati ya wanuda 
e vanogona kubatsira futi nemari kana poombi wa homwe kumisangani yao kuti vagone kukwanisa kufamba vachikambena mukati menzimbo dzakasena siya kubatsira futi nemari kana poombi wa homwe vanenge vagane yao kuti vagone kukwanisa kufamba vachikambena mukati menzimbo yeah on that note i think uh, we've come to the end of our show uh, today so that was uh, pastor uh, richard moyo in south africa so he's appealing uh, to people to actually register but he says it's difficult to actually do this so uh, we wish to thank our guests uh, this evening uh, mr tabo siziba and miss Man manangwenya uh, they both, both belong to us take the walk then we had pastor richard moyo and mr ernest Itinuke of the mtc alliance based in south africa signing off is keeps jube in washington dc saying good night zimbabwe and i'm marvelous and fun and saying have a very good night and let's meet tomorrow on let's talk that's it for you good night <laughs>